Well, good morning, everyone. It is an honor to uh, be with you this morning uh, <laughs> by way of video. And I just wanted to ask you today if you would please pray for the middle schools and the high schools of the greater Pittsburgh region. My name is Travis Deans. I work with a ministry called Teens for Christ, and we help students start uh, Bible clubs, Christian clubs in their schools. Uh, we like to call them outreach clubs because we like to encourage students to be focused on reaching out to their friends and sharing God's love with them. Uh, we work uh, closely with uh, a, a lot of Assembly of God churches in the region, and we're, we're thankful for that partnership. Uh, and uh, recently, at the Fearless Conference, which took place at Calvary Assembly over in Irwin, uh, your youth pastor Daniel brought a group of students, and they got to hear some of the training on how to start uh, an outreach-focused cl club in their high school. And so, uh, we also did a follow-up meeting uh, with um, one of your students about starting a, uh, one of those clubs at Bentworth, and that was very exciting. Uh, so we. Just want to ask you to please pray for Bentworth High School, but there's also uh, in the greater Pittsburgh region like uh, 99 more schools, literally 99 that don't have a Christian presence and uh, you know an organized, purposeful, intentional Christian presence. Uh, students who want to reach students in those schools, um, you know, our public schools today are a mission field. They really are. They're full of students who are far from God. At least 9 out of 10 students that walk through our high school hallways don't know Christ, and they don't know the gospel message. Who's going to reach them? Well, to be honest, there's really no one better to reach them than their fellow students. Christian students really are the best ones to reach uh, teenagers in their schools. And so if a school is a mission field, uh, that makes each new school year a nine-month mission trip. And that makes our Christian students missionaries to their schools. So I just want to encourage you today to please pray over the students in your church. Pray that God would give them a burning passion to show his love, to share his truth with students in their schools. We always encourage students to you know, find ways to do kind things, to, to be a blessing to other students in their school, uh, to open that door. You know, people are a lot more willing to hear about God's love if they have experienced it uh, in their own lives. And we know that God's love is not a just mushy feelings or something like that. God's love is holy and He is a holy God um, <clears throat> who wants us to be holy, to make us holy. Uh, we know that, but uh, it's, you know, you have to start somewhere. And so we encourage students, hey, uh, show God's love to the students in your school and ask God for opportunities to share His truth with them. So I just want to encourage you today, please pray for the, the Christian students in your church, that God would use them as missionaries to their school. Pray for these high, uh, all the high schools in our region that, that need some kind of campus ministry, high schools and middle schools. Uh, please pray for the teachers and the principals and administrators, coaches, support staff that work at our schools in our region. Uh, God is at work in our public schools. We just have to be praying and asking God to show us what He's doing so that we can join Him in that work. Thanks so much for your time this morning. Thanks so much for praying for the schools in our region. And uh, if you're, you know, if you're interested in more, uh, we have a couple of websites: ninemonthmissiontrip.com uh, and another one called studentoutreachclubs.com, where we help churches launch uh, campus ministries in high schools. And of course. Uh, uh, you guys have the Youth Alive, which does a fantastic job of campus ministry uh, all around the country. Uh, we love partnering with you guys on that. Uh, but thank you so much for your time. Thank you for praying for our schools.